This next guy knows a thing or two about championships. He's a silent leader in Newton, or is he really so silent? Let's head to Eagle Country to meet the 12 star athlete of the week. For the past couple of seasons, Newton Eagle fans have been used to seeing senior Josh Foster line up under center. Uh, I just like the ball. It don't matter where it is. Just give me the ball, allow me to make plays. That's all I want. Over the last few games, it's been hard to keep up with number five. He's running jet sweeps, catching passes Odell Beckham Jr. style, and perfectly executing corner post routes for six out of the slot receiver position. Just being able to move around and make more plays for the team, just it's a lot of fun doing that. And uh, it just shows coaches that I'm very versatile, can play in different spots, not just one position. Darwin Barlow says he's enjoyed the new role Foster's been playing in the Eagles offense. Showing that everyone what he could do all around the field and how much of an athlete he really is instead of just being a quarterback. But, I mean, I love it. We all get to touch the ball and have fun with it. So we get it. He can play any position on the field. But who is the real Josh Foster? It, the teachers, they think he's just a quiet, good, good boy. You know, he's uh, good with the kids and everybody during out of school. He likes to have fun and interact with people. He's just the type of person he needs. He is the most energetic person. On the football field and at practice, he wants everybody to work hard. It's just, it's just the mentality you got to have. So that's, Josh, that's how Josh is. Here's a fact you may not know about the future TCU Horn Frog. I used to be in band. My mama never wanted me to play it. But I really wanted to play the drums, but they wanted me to play like a real instrument. So I played saxophone. So now that Foster's winning all this KBMT 12 News attention, I want to know from James Sylvester, will he be the homecoming king too? Mm, Kristen Paulette, Darwin, and Josh, that's it. You so. think Josh will prevail? Yeah, Josh gonna win. I already know he's gonna win. I mean, it's Josh Foster. Why wouldn't he win? I guess we'll find out this Friday night. And the race is tight between Lumberton and Bridge City. Go to 12news.now.com slash bands to vote for your favorite band. Will it be Bridge City or Lumberton in the 409 Sports Game of the Week? Final look at your forecast coming up after the break.